welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming back and taking a couple minutes out of your day to spend some time with me. I was waving my arms around and realized that my nails look wretched. Sorry, don't look at my hands. Well, I'm gonna do something a little bit different today. Basically, I just want to update you guys on something fun that I did a couple weeks ago. I think it was um, maybe two weeks ago now. I went on a road trip by myself. First time ever going on a road trip by myself and it was so fucking fun. Like I can't even explain to you how fun it was to just be on my own timetable. I drove, I think it was um, a total of like 450 miles, something like that, like 400 plus miles to Atlanta, Georgia to see one of my favorite bands, us the duo, in case you couldn't tell. And it was honestly so much fun. They are a married couple who are also a band and they're on a world tour right now just by themselves, not with like a backup band or anything like that. They're just out by themselves going around. They have finished the US leg of the tour and they just flew to, I believe, Ireland. So they're in Europe right now, gonna be there for a month touring. So if you're in Europe and you're watching this video, first of all, holy shit, that's really cool. Hi. Um, but check them out. I heard about them when they opened for Pentatonix on their world tour in 2016. How else would I have heard about anything? You guys know that I'm obsessed with Pentatonix. And they came out, they did their opening set, and then they came back out again in the middle of the show to sing a song with them. And they were so good, you guys. And their chemistry is amazing. They are literally goals on every level, like relationship goals, career goals, life goals, puppy goals. They're so cute. They're both named after Michael Jackson songs, Billie Jean and Thriller. They're so adorable. They call their fans us the family, so I thought it would be only appropriate to tag my road trip photos and videos with us the road trip. And they actually liked basically everything I tweeted. You put that hashtag while I was on my road trip. And it was so, so cool. It's just nice to see that they care about their fans so much. They take time to respond to them and like their posts and like the stuff that their fans comment on their photos. And they actually sent me, like responded to the Snapchat that I sent them at the concert to say thanks so much for driving all this way to come to our show. And like, I can't think of any other musical act that would do that for their fans. That's so unbelievably cool. And I'm so proud to be such a big fan. And if you guys are watching this, hey, um, so the band is made up of Michael and Carissa Alvarado. I will put the links to their social media accounts in the description box below so that you guys can check them out because you definitely should. So while I was in Atlanta, I drove there by myself. It was about a seven hour drive and I stayed with a friend who lives there. So I wasn't by myself 100% of the time. I'd say maybe 80% of the time I was by myself. I went to the Coke factory while I was there, which was absolutely so cool and so interesting to learn about the history of Coke. Although I did notice that they left out of the tour that they used to put cocaine in Coke, which is why people loved it so much and it was so addicting. But I mean, they don't do it anymore, I think. I thought the Coke factory was super cool and it's not expensive at all. I also went to the Georgia Aquarium, which was amazing. If you've never been to the Georgia Aquarium, it's amazing. Definitely go if you're in the area, check it out. It's enormous, there are so many cool animals there. The staff was super nice and friendly and helpful. My friend that I went and stayed with, she went with me to the aquarium and to the concert. But other than that, I was by myself the entire time. I don't know, just the past couple of years, I felt like I'd become a lot more dependent on my friends. I didn't want to go out and do anything alone. So this was really huge. I would say the last year, I've been doing a lot more things by myself, going to movies, going out to eat, just going somewhere in public and sitting and people watching and just being by myself. And it's been amazing. If you feel comfortable enough to drive somewhere, even if it's not seven hours away, even if it's like 30 minutes down the road to go to this place that you really love for lunch, but you never go by yourself, you always have to bring a friend with you, try going and doing that by yourself. It was so, so, so much fun to go on a road trip by myself and I think that I would definitely do it again. Obviously going on road trips with friends is a lot of fun. You have a lot of energy and people around you and always somebody to talk to, but sometimes it's nice to just kind of do your own thing and just be chill and just 
relax. So the point of this video is to fill you guys in on that and just to say, you know, if you haven't done it, definitely try to do something like that. Learn a little bit more about yourself and become more comfortable with who you are and being you because you're awesome. Be you. And I also wanted to share some of the videos and photos that I took on my trip with you guys. Um, you can find more photos on all of my social media accounts. I snapchatted the entire time I was there and I was updating my Instagram story. If you follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, you know if you would like to follow me on Snapchat and Instagram and Twitter, you can find the links to those in the description box below. I'll put those down there and I'll be posting more pictures from my hashtag us the road trip on all of those social media platforms. So you guys can check those out. But I did want to scroll a couple of them here so you guys can kind of see what I was up to. And honestly, it was just so much fun that I just want to keep telling people about it. Thank you so much for coming back and watching another video, taking time out of your day to listen to me ramble on about my life. I really, really appreciate it. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Do you guys want to hear some us the duo? Let's listen to it. It's so good. Can you hear it?